Hello, as most of the current population is dealing with the state of chronic dehydration, so there is a need for a regulatory check on this unnoticeable state. We have designed a variable hydration detector to detect the hydration values from the impedance values of the skin. Uh, the skin, the composition of the skin can be represented as an RC equivalent circuit. Uh, here is our design. AD5933 is an impedance converter system. Here is an analog front end and here is a tissue under study. AD5933 basically ex gives an excitation signal to the analog front end which is basically used for voltage to current conversion to basically gather the current difference from tissue under study. The response signal from tissue under study is given back to voltage to current converter system and further to AD5933. From uh, the response signal from AD5, uh, which we have given to AD5933 basically gives the real and imaginary values of the impedance at each sweeping frequency. These values are further given to Bluetooth module. The impedance values that are generated from the AD5933 will be transmitted over to the Android phone using the Bluetooth module DBM01. The impedance values that are picked up will be passed through a Java code and will generate a hex code. That hex code will be given in to the software real term on which the DBM01 is operated and that integer value will be displayed in word form on that software. We can also display this uh, integer value generated by the uh, impedance analyzer on RGB LED. Coming to the hardware part, this is AD5933 impedance analyzer. The excitation signal from the impedance analyzer is given to the left electrode pad. The response signal from the right electrode pad is given back to the impedance analyzer. The values of the analyzer can be seen on screen as a graph. The frequency sweep starting from 40 kHz to 60 kHz keeping mean frequency at 50 kHz can be seen on the graph. Taking average of all the impedance values, it can be seen that 3, 4, 5, 5, 5, 6 ohms came out to be average impedance which can be further displayed on the Android phone via, via Bluetooth module. It can be seen on the Android phone that the value 3, 4, 5k ohms is displayed which can be further displayed as a wristband through RGB LED via Arduino Uno. It can be seen that blue signal is generated which signifies that the person is fully hydrated.